what I wanted to communicate in my in my pieces were um, just the just the, the chaos, but the the joy in it, and 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 just um, taking those moments to. Um, just breathe and, and, and look around and, and say to yourself, it's, it's not that serious, you know, the, the messy house can wait and, um, you know, these are the moments that you want to just, um, like even this morning I was washing the dishes and, and Tyler came up to me with a, with a book, he, book, book. And so, you know, what was more important at that moment? He wanted, he wanted me to read him a book. So I, I dried my hands and I sat on the kitchen floor right under the sink and, and we read a book. And so um, those are the ty type of things that I wanted to kind of put across where that even though um, life with two boys can get a little crazy, they're, they're still my children and I love them and I want to do my best to kind of take a step back from whatever crazy situation it is and, and enjoy the moment. I would say my message to mothers who are expecting their second child is that it is tough in the beginning, um, not just because they're so young and you're dealing with the dynamics of your toddler um, either being jealous or just needing so much attention while your, your newborn is needing so much more attention. Um, I think the lesson that I learned is that um, although it, it's hard, it it does go by so fast, even faster than you might once. And I, I, even now I look at my little one and I say, God, I cannot believe he used to fit right here and he's already running around and climbing into things. And um, I do miss those moments. So I would just say to just treasure um, those moments as stressed out as you are and, um, and know that it does get easier um, once you start getting adjusted to your, your schedule and um, just figuring it out, figuring it all out. Um, it's just harder in the beginning because you're, you're, you're learning. Everyone is learning. So um, it, it does get better. There's light at the end of the tunnel. <laughs>